You may have heard about the dozens of companies testing lab-grown chicken and beef, hoping to break into the alternative meat market, which Barclays estimates could be worth $140 billion by 2029. But a Singapore-based startup is wading into crustaceans, catering for more diverse diets. And most of the companies that have, have started in the last three to four years have concentrated on red and white meat because that is what is consumed much more in the West. Shiok Meat says it's the first company to grow shrimp and lobster in the lab. It extracts cell samples, feeds them nutrients, and then nurtures the stem cells into meat over four to six weeks. So all of the magic basically happens here. The proof of the so-called clean meat is in the taste. One of our reporters tried it out themselves. It just tastes like a regular dumpling. But it doesn't come cheap. And this dumpling by itself cost about two to three hundred dollars to make. 2.2 pounds of shrimp meat currently costs five thousand dollars. Ninety percent of our cost from that is actually this nutrient solution that you see everywhere. The company hopes that cost will be lowered by a hundred times this year. Its eco-credentials may be appetising too. Land-based farming has long been known for its environmental impact, one of the selling points for alternative beef or poultry. Aquaculture is no different. It's been blamed for hits to mangroves and other ecosystems across Asia, and some farms have been criticised for overuse of antibiotics.